Hello, I'm Callie G, your very own. I'm Stephanie Ripley. And this is my very own. Yeah. <laughs> this is my drag mother, yeah. and we've decided um, it's let's see, it's almost June. August is like my drag birthday. Okay. I guess like July. Yeah. July. So the summertime is my drag birthday, and kind of to commemorate, I did. Uh, we came. I came up with the idea of like putting my drag mother face because when I started out, I had a very like real woman look mm -hmm. and now it's kind of evolved a little bit it's always changing and i want to see what you look like as me okay now so <laughs> let's do it i'm not a tutorial type of girl i'm just gonna oh talk we're gonna have a conversation oh honey how you doing honey honey oh did you hear honey did you hear honey about honey, you know honey. honey oh honey you know oh, honey, honey. <laughs> we do theater together. We do. So we're very knowledgeable about the wigs and the <laughs> and the makeup. Um, but I'm getting more knowledgeable about a different side of that. So this is a new venture for me. Sir, ma'am. Ma'am. What do I call you, sir, ma'am? You can call Sally, me whatever you want. So you don't have rehearsal with me? I do not. That's awesome. I know. It's you actually... like the men or something. No, they're just off. I think everybody is on vacation for Memorial Day. Gotcha. So she just decided, look, we're just not going to have rehearsal. Don't tell the audience what you're doing. We are doing Fiddler on the Roof at the Stevens Performing Arts Center. It's the ISU Summer Musical. And who are you playing? I am Golda. Golda? Golda, darling. And tell people who don't know about Fiddler on the Roof about it. Golda is the mother of the main family married to Tevye, and he is the main lead father role. Oh, you mean he's the fiddler? He's not the fiddler. He's the <laughs> father. Kolbe <laughs> is like half bitch, half awesome mother, half like lord of the castle at the same time as Tevye acts like he is. Yeah. So, <laughs> I think Gold is the true lord of the castle, and we talked about this with our daughters, uh, that... They run to their dad when they want something, and the mother is the intimidation factor, so the roles are slightly reversed. So when I was starting out, you had me do like a, you like, she like drew a map on the back of like one of these flyers that we had for the show, said mush, mush mix or whatever, mm -hmm. and I always followed that, now I just kind of go to town. Yeah, the, and I use like, I had like three very similar shades of the same, <laughs> of uh, tan. Uh, now I use like white. White for the, yeah. Mm -hmm. And it all blends together. Isn't that amazing? I, because I found I that it. schematic, mm -hmm. um, and a bunch of stuff that I had been keeping. Stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um. Oh God. Perfect face. Like I, I, I have like, <laughs> like oh, my chin smooth. goes straight through, yeah. and you're like jaw. Jaw. <laughs> so I'm getting it like in weird places because I can't draw it on the same way. <laughs> uh, no, I found it. I'm gonna put it in my scrapbook. And my grandmother got me like four years ago that I was supposed to start scrapbooking and she never did. No, I actually love and admire so much the drag queen. And I have followed so many wonderful artists on Instagram because their pictures are so fantastic. And their makeup, I can't even believe it. I don't see women as incredible. No, I, I feel those. that's kind of the point. Oh, it, it doesn't have so... anything to do with the fact that the women are oh. women. It's just like this over exaggeration. Oh, it's amazing. And you always told me stuff about that. You were always the one yeah. that was like, okay, so you look very pretty, Joe, but right. also you're a drag. <laughs> yep. So let's talk about that for a second. Be let's be huge. Yeah, let's be big. What oh, are you going to do to make a dragon? Yep. I always remember dragon. that. Dragon. Oh, good these days. Thank you. Do you like my red under boob? I think you have. Um, from the cup size too. Because <laughs> yeah. wouldn't we pick out like these? Bees. I was bees. you were like, Yeah. Do these look good, John? I'm like, sure. Sure, he has no sure. idea and they're A's or B's. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> no, like, I had a, should work up to a C. Yeah, I had a sometimes. friend who was very much just like, You need to have like big boobs. Yeah. I just yeah. it wasn't for me. That's the nice size. I think you're like a C. Is yeah, a C? I don't know. You, I you picked it out and I'm like, this is cool. Yeah. Um, yeah. No, I had, like, what happened? I have a lot of dresses that 
because my shoulders are so broad, I have like a lot of fat here. <laughs> if I like want to fit into them well, have everything else be proportionate. This is this doesn't really fit me. Uh, it kind of does. It's nice and short. really short. Yeah. Mickey got this and she's like, this is this is too short for me. I'm like, oh, I maybe it'll like fit me. Underbra. No, I do yeah, like the underbra. Underbra. <laughs> no, if I put too big of boobs, then it doesn't work. Yeah, you look like a. I look like I, I could be in an opera. The last project that we did was ca the cabaret, the Valentine's yes. cabaret, which was so much fun. I love it, and we're set to do it again next year. Mm -hmm. So we are we are a yearly cabaret happening at yes. Otas. It's great because of the genius Bartosi. Bartosi is really good at making out songs and mm -hmm. stuff. We've done a lot of stuff with Bartos. Oh, yeah. He's done a lot of great people. And Jason plays our piano in the cabaret. So it's live accompaniment, live singers. Live everything. But you don't get to see a lot. No. I don't, you know, I don't get to see a lot of live stuff. No. You don't interact too much. True. His blending job could use a little. So I'm hoping he's going to do something. <laughs> People have asked me to like do the makeup and like have me be their mother. I'm like, I'm not like, doing this line. Oh, gotcha. Right? It's just, yep. it's not, it's not, it's not the time. Mm -hmm. It's not the time of the place for anything. Like a little more. Yeah. That's Even nice then. Brush. I like that brush. Thank you. <laughs> I got it at uh, Ross. Well, I can feel my makeup baking. Ooh. I put like extra emphasis on my nose because my nose is. There's Girl, like that's a, a great nose. It's a nose. It's a sharp line. She has nose. like, she's, oh, I am such an admirer of your face. She's great. How? Your face is just gorgeous. Well, the thank you. you. I'm not denying this, but girl, <laughs> Isn't that funny work when mama you start, boots. When you start doing makeup, you start appreciating facial shape. Oh yeah, I remember. And I remember going through that. Look. I was like, girl, yeah. I know. Yeah. So and I think that that's an interesting thing because it's not like boys don't notice those things, but I they am. don't. You don't notice them like a makeup artist notices right. them, or like right. a drag queen notices them. People who right. have to pay attention to what that looks like. Because my thing about drag is you want to take the features of yourself, accentuate them, accentuate them. Because this is a really big feature on myself, so I'm doing like my makeup on her. I've been getting really fast makeup too. Awesome. Little shop, we had to come an extra hour early to do makeup because. Well, you did. I did it at I, home because I was so frustrated. At the end, you did. Yes. At the start, you did it at the show. At the theater. But by the end, Joe could put on his own wig. <laughs> oh yeah, putting on the wig draw. was like. Yeah, what am I gonna do? Your wig. How do I do this? Yeah. I forgot about that. And then, I was such an idiot. Really you good. could. Talk. I, no, I was. He could and do everything by himself by I, the end. I, I own it. I needed help. Yeah. And you helped me. So. Good stuff. <sighs> this is a very clean yeah. makeup room. I appreciate I'm quite it. Impressed. Did you expect? Well, everybody takes their stuff home at the end well, of the yeah, week. Well, yeah, but it's still. I don't know. It's, it's very impressive. It's very neat. Very clean. Ladies, room is just very good. I'm still not that great at eye makeup. I have to take my time. It's so different doing it on another person. Too. It is. Very, very, very. Well, because well, you're not doing it backwards. Right. In the mirror. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Your own eyelids, which you're used to. What either a woman has to do every day, or what a drag queen has to do constantly. Well, I mean, but also it's important to take into account that not every woman does that every day. That's very true. That's not, that's not the reality for everybody. No, but you, you would say, knowing the women that were in that cast. Yeah, which is all very I see what you do, and I, I'm like, wow, how do you, what, ugh. And then we would say, well, we don't always. <laughs> yeah, right. But me as a, as a person that works in the professional field, I have to in a way because it's kind of one of those expected things. I do marketing and sometimes if I show up with my sick face on, you know, no makeup, no this, they go, uh, you know, there's this interesting perception that it's expected that you have to look a certain way. face is so <laughs> I'm literally about. I'm di I'm dying. You're so funny. What the fuck? What? I don't even see what you're doing. <laughs> it's too far away. 
Are you blind? I can't see. I'm it. like putting like a lot of black okay. on black. Mm -hmm. I usually curl my lashes before I do my eyeshadow. Just saying. Gotcha. Just well, I don't see, but when I curl my lashes and I can't yeah. get in there yeah. as much, does that make sense? Yeah. Don't open your eyes. I won't open my eyes! Swear to God, open! I'm opening them in three, two, one. No, don't. So, who taught Jared makeup? Her. Really? Yeah. Wow. She just, she's a makeup whore. She just had so much makeup. I'm like, girl, what the fuck is going on with you? But you should be a deaf I don't think that was my first thing. I'm just like, I'm happy as a of all the makeup. She taught herself. We went out, did a couple gigs. Then Spike decided that she would make her her daughter. And then Spike taught her how to like refine her and stuff. She that. that is awesome. So, and I mean, I would be lying if I said I didn't take up, pick up anything. Yeah. <laughs> okay, do you want to? Ah, uh, yes. Now I can. Okay. I, I have to see in the mirror. That's fine. That's fine. You can look at my boobs. <laughs> <laughs> do you want to do your own mascara? Yes. I like this mascara. This is the one that he had probably. This is the from, one that we bought. We yes, bought together. She, she took me to the Rite Aid. Or little to shop. And he says, this is what my mom uses. And that's why he got it. But it really has like the best bristle brush of all Plus, the mascaras that are out there. If you're spending too much on mascara, you're crazy. Yep. Oh, so for him to have this me. like a year later two is years scary. Later. It's two years. Two years. And I'm using it on my eyeballs. These are 301. Say hey. They're huge. Yeah. Joe is slathering on the glue. I mean, slather. Yep. I use like the finest, tiniest little line. <laughs> He's well, like, it needs to work. He's got it needs it. to stay on throughout it. the entire night for like all yeah. the shows and things. Uh huh. And the sweat. And, and the sweat. Mm -hmm. And so, through trade. Mm hmm. You don't even know what trade is. Nope. I'm disagreeing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what the fuck I just did. He just. He just. He did it. They're on. Wow. Would you consider like working a drag joint once? Sure. Yeah. Just for the experience. Oh, yeah. Would they really let a real woman do it? Oh, yeah, we do. We have a couple. Oh, that's people. fun. I would mm -hmm. totally do that. We call it bio queens. Blush. That's it. That's all I do. And this Amazing. is the wig. Okay. I made a matcher matcher. Okay. I know you said how much you liked it when I came in. <laughs> I've never been a blonde. That's why I Actually, I, I That's how I learned how to do my Brooklyn, well, my Brooklyn esque. It could be like. That's how we. Could we, we kept like, um. Hi going off of each other. <laughs> <laughs> okay. There, we did it. Mother and daughter. <laughs> we should Snapchat. We should Snapchat. Okay. Love you very much. This was your very own Kelly G. Bye bye. And you've ever yelled Fairfield G. <laughs> I've created a monster. Uh, yeah! This, this lighting is something. It's awful! I love it though. There we go. This is the ideal. Video. Yes. <laughs> With the phone and everything. <laughs>
Why are you more beautiful than me? Because <laughs> I'm not. Because she's naturally more beautiful than me, and I just made her even more beautiful.